What's going on guys? CTA Prime back here again. I recently built a new gaming PC and I'll be doing a video on it very shortly in the next couple days, but I wanted to test out some PS2 games in 4K. My last rig just went and cut it with most of these games in 4K, so I figured I'd test it on my new one. A quick rundown on the specs, 9600K stock clock, 16GB DDR4, and an RTX 2080. This was not specifically built for emulation, but we can emulate on it, so I figured I'd go ahead and try. I do have window screen scaling set at 250%, but before I start the games I will turn it to 100%. I'm using the GeForce Experience to capture my screen at 4K, and this is all running on a 42 inch LG 4K display. But before we get started with 4K, I kind of wanted to do a little comparison, just some screenshots. This is the native PS2 resolution of Bloody Roar 4, and this is 4K resolution. Native. 4K. Native. 4K. Here's a quick clip of Bloody Roar 4 running at the native resolution. And here we have 4K. So I'm not going to do this with every game. 4K looks much better than native in every game. There's a lot of games that I wanted to test, but I didn't want to draw this video out too much, so I'm going to be testing a few games that I still like to play today. I did want to test Tekken 5, but unfortunately when you try to scale that up to 4K, you get black lines. And God of War 2 actually has a lot of ghosting going on for some odd reason. One of my favorite franchises of all time is Ratchet & Clank. This is Ratchet & Clank Up Your Arsenal 4K, and it looks absolutely amazing. Your maximum nanotech level has increased. Gran Turismo 4, this is one of those games I could hardly go over 720p with my last rig. And if you look at the very top, we're using close to 70% of this RTX 2080 GPU. And in the past, I have done a video on PC SX2 using GPU power. GPUs do matter with these newer emulators. Shadow of the Colossus is just one of those games that I've always had trouble with. Now lower resolutions have been no issue, but even on this rig, I'm still struggling to hit 60 FPS at 4K. And we're almost at 100% GPU usage on the RTX 2080.
And finally, Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 4. It's a totally different game at 4K. It looks really good. So that's pretty much it for this video, guys. Those were just a few games that I wanted to test out real quick. There's a lot of other games that I do want to mess around with. I just need to find the time to do it. And if you want to see another video like this, let me know in the comments below. I don't know how well these go over. I think 4K PS2 emulation is awesome, but it does take some power to do. If you could, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and like always, thanks for watching.